You once said the saddest two words in the English language are too late. Do you have any regrets? No. Well, do I? No, I don't think so. It, when I, if I say things like that, I'm thinking of things like that the time when we could have recognised the Aboriginal claim to this country is now past. And all the messing about with the Constitution isn't going to fix it. We can't make it make sense. 500,000 people in Australia now claim Aboriginal descent. So how do we put that in the Constitution? Well, clearly, we can't. We can't find a way of... It. We like to think of Aboriginal people as living out there on their traditional lands in Lajamanu or wherever. That's not who they are now. Um, and we, the moment is gone. But that also means that we have no way of assuaging our guilt and remorse for what happened. Um, and all the apologies in the world aren't going to make it better. And the other thing about the apologies is that nobody asks the Aboriginal peoples if they accept them. They just mm -hmm. give them and assume that they've been accepted, mm -hmm. uh, which just goes to show how little understanding we have of the profound sense of grievance which persists and persists and persists and will distort our politics forever. But it's too late now to fix it. That's the way I use too late. It's too late for me. Well, it was, you know, menopause came, too late to have a child. Uh, but that's fine. 